Hi. In this week's 2 minute concept video, we will explain your financial ratio with the example of Bhushan Steel Limited. Financial ratios are tools used to assess the relative strength of companies by performing simple calculation on items of income statement, balance sheet and cash flow statement. Ratio on profitability, liquidity and leverage gives the investor an insight of company's financial situation and further he can compare it with its peer. For easy understanding of the ratio, let's take an example of Bhushan Steel Limited. Let's start off with profitability ratio. Profitability ratio are of great importance as it gives the sense to the investor about how effectively the management is generating profit. Higher the ratio, better it is for the company. Gross profit margin and net profit margin are the two most common profitability ratio. Gross profit margin is calculated by dividing EBITDA by net sales, where EBITDA means earning before interest, tax and depreciation. For Bhushan Steel, gross profit margin is equal to 27.8%, whereas net profit margin is calculated by net profit by net sales. For Bhushan Steel, net profit margin is equal to 0.61%. Company's gross profit margin is good, but the net profit margin is worrisome and indicates that company has huge interest outflow. Now comes the liquidity ratio. This ratio measures the ability of a company to pay off its short-term liability when they fall due. Hard liquidity ratio is good for the company as it indicates the ability of a company to service its short-term debt obligation comfortably. Current and quick ratio are the two most common liquidity ratio used. Current ratio is calculated by dividing current asset by current liabilities. For Bhushan still current ratio is equal to 0.82. Whereas, quick ratio is calculated by dividing the difference of current asset and inventories by current liabilities. For Bhushan still quick ratio is equal to 0.31. Liquidity ratio indicates that the company is having liquidity crunch as the ratio is below 1, which means current liabilities are greater than current assets. Now let's talk about leverage ratio. Leverage ratio is meant to evaluate a company's debt level, both long term and short term creditor are concerned about the level of debt that the company is carrying on its book as it affects the company's ability in meeting its debt obligation. Lower the ratio, better it is for the company as it means that the company has enough asset to cover its debt. Ideally, the company should have ratio less than 0.5. Following are some common leverage ratio used. Debt to equity ratio is calculated by dividing company's total debt by total shareholders' equity. For Bhushan Steel, debt to equity ratio is equal to 3.84. Debt to sales ratio is calculated by dividing company's total debt by net sales. For Bhushan Steel, debt to sales ratio is equal to 3.64. Leverage ratio indicates poor debt profile of the company as its debt is 3.84 times of shareholder equity and 3.64 times of annual sales. For further understanding on financial ratio and analysis, register to our online financial market training program. Thank you.